Hey everybody, it's Brandon Rocco, and guess what? We're going on a beer adventure. <laughs> it's been a while. It's been a while. So we thought, what the heck? Let's try something out. Uh, today's beer comes to us from Three Floyds Brewing, which is in Munster, Indiana. And I've actually had a few of their beers before, just not this one. I think my favorite from them was a Scottish style ale called Robert the Bruce. Really full, rich flavor. It was really good. So today's beer is a harvest ale, and it is called Brewdoo. Um, according to Three Floyds, the calling card for this beer is that they don't dry their hop, dry the hops for this one. They go from the vine to the brew house in a single day. There's no messing around. They call them wet or green hops, and literally vine to brew house one day. So this should be interesting. This should be interesting. Um, before we get started, if you're new to the channel, hit the like button, subscribe, ring the bell. Leave, leave little man a comment. Let Rocco know, you know, if there's something you want us to try. And you know what? We'll, we'll see if we can find it. If we can, we'll try it. Um, if you don't want to do that, that's fine. We get it. We're not for everybody. You know, we're just having fun. We're not being paid. Not monetized at all. It's a hobby for us. We buy it, we try it, and we let you know if we like it or not. So, what do you think, Rocco? What do you think, little man? You ready? Are you ready? Yeah? Are you ready? Okay. You go first. As always, Rocco goes first. Here we go. Three Floyds. Brew do. Ready? Here you go. Here we go. Can we give that one a shot? Uh-oh. 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 <laughs> All right. Two paws up. Two paws up from Rocco. All right. Yeah. Can I have some now? Can I have some now? My huh, baby boy? Yeah? Okay. All right. All right. All right. Hit the road. Hit the road. My turn. Who's that? Uh-oh. Come here. Okay. Here's someone you haven't met yet. Years and years ago, I lived in Michigan. I believe it was about nine years ago, and I worked for, for a large home improvement company. And there was this skinny little kitten that was just hanging around our lumber area. He was just starving, covered in fleas. He'd count his ribs. I felt sorry for him. I brought him home. Nine years later, look at this guy. Fat, happy and living in Kentucky. <laughs> His name is Lucky. And he is like, he's the patriarch of our cats. He's the OJ. All right, you ready to get down? Okay. I love you, big boy. You're my big boy, yeah. Okay. <coughs> All right, Th it is my turn. Brewdoo, Three Floyds Brewing, Munster, Indiana, in the shorts glass. Yeah, it's a, nice and cloudy. I can't actually see through it, so let's see. We're going to give it a shot. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Okay. You know what? Two thumbs up. <laughs> Three Floyds, you did it again. This is a very rich, full-flavored beer that you can taste tons of hops. It is really hoppy. It's got some spice notes in it. I can really taste kind of some spices on, on the finish, on the back end. A bit on the bitter side, but I expected as much from a Harvest Ale. And, but really, it's, it's got a good, a little bit of a floral note, a little bit of a citrus note. Almost an IPA type taste, almost. Not quite as bitter, although there's some bitterness there. So, Three Floyds, Brewdew. Two thumbs up for me. <laughs> and while I'm here, I uh, just wanted to let you know, I'm not, this isn't, obviously this isn't the only beer channel on YouTube. We, ours is small, we don't beg for subscribers. This is a hobby. If you like what we do, you'll subscribe. If you don't, you won't. We're fine with that. 
I also subscribe to other beer channels. And there are, I'm going to, there's a few that I really enjoy. So if you get a chance, check out Stoneyard Vineyards. Um, this guy, he, he's converted his garage to a brewery. I converted my garage to a woodworking shop. He converted his house to a beer shop. And while he'll, he'll occasionally um, try some beers and give a review, mostly he takes us through the brewing process of some of his beers, and they really look good. And it's, it's a blast. I watch every video he puts out. So uh, Stoneyard Vineyards is a great one. I subscribe to it. Another one I subscribe to is Beer and a Joke. This is a gentleman probably about my age. I know, I'm old. Uh, he's in Canada. And he just sits down at his table and he tries a new beer. And after he tries that beer, gives his opinion on that on that brew, he tells a joke. And usually it's something off color or it's a dad joke. And it's great. I watch every video he does and his are similar. His are like four or five minutes like mine are. Um, another, another one I do like is Wish You Were a Beer. They're a little bit bigger, a lot of production. And... They, but they have a lot of good information on beers, and they, they try a lot of new stuff. Uh, my only complaint with them is their videos are way too long. I, I rarely sit through the whole thing, but I will, I do watch them. And yeah, they're, they're pretty good too. So anyways, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. On behalf of Rocco, thanks for watching us today. And as always, keep drinking the good stuff, and we will see you all next time.